Hi guys, in this module I want to show you how you can bring a Visio diagram into a Word document and why you might want to do that. So first of all I'm in Word and I'm going to try and do a simple flowchart using the Word tools. So let's have a quick look. Shapes is where I'm going to go. Shapes, it gets it a little I can either use a rectangle shape or further down you've actually got flow chart shape so I'll just use that one draw and just to make a point I'm just gonna copy this down with my control key and like so just need three shapes now what you have to do there is you then have to link these up like so now there's a problem straight off because I'm not getting any circles appearing and what is going to happen now even though that looks okay if I move that shape it loses the connection there is no connection so what you have to do in Word to achieve um, shapes that will stay together is this you have to first of all insert shapes create a drawing canvas which is right down the bottom here and then insert the shapes inside uh, drawing canvas I'll just use rectangles but you see the difference so again I'm just going to copy a couple of shapes three shapes now watch what happens if I click the elbow connector I get the circles and I get the circles so now if I move that around this stays with it I didn't connect it to the top one properly just pick it up again sit it on top of one of the circles it should then be glued into position like so now you don't have to do that in Excel but you do have to do that in Word you can set the, the drawing canvas as a default option in options otherwise it's not going to be on and then you would have to do this yourself very manually like so so that's what you have to do in Word and even then I'm not getting that top connection connection on correctly that's it I think if I move that middle one it should stay yeah it does but they are sitting inside this drawing canvas and that's how you would achieve a flowchart with connectors that stay together so you can maneuver shapes around the screen in Word now if I just close that off if I do control A and delete everything delete the canvas so I've got no canvas another way of doing that a better way I think is you can go insert object which is over here object and then if you've got Visio already created you can search for it or if it's going to be a blank one you just scroll down for it which is what I'm going to do Visio drawing that one if you've got an older version that one okay and then it will embed a Visio diagram into this word document it gives you the options down the left hand side of different categories there's flow charts i just want a basic simple flow chart but there are, there you can see there are other ones that you could select so just click on this one and then it will load that stencil and just go back up the screen a bit just cancel that off okay so it's just had a window open there so just need to close that down and then here is the this your stencil or diagram embedded into this word document which I just need to make a little bit bigger obviously it can't be too big because of the size of the page but let's have a look what happens here I drag a shape that's going to come onto the screen and if you activate the connector tool what you can then very quickly do is just put shapes in there and it will it will connect up automatically whichever way you go and then you've got this little tool so I could go that way and then I could come down uh, do that one and then come back across do that one and then if I want to I can come down and draw a line there manually but very quickly I'm able to draw a diagram and if I knock the pointer tool on then you can just type in there whatever your process is 
these are decision symbols so yes no step two and so on step three and you can see how this works and then when you have finished with your diagram you just click back onto your word document and that will be embedded into the diagram like so now I've gone a bit over there so I need to go back into this and just reposition these now to go back into this you just double click you're back into Visio and you can see I've gone off the page a little bit there so if I just move these up move this one back onto the page so you are limited in the, the, the size of a diagram but to be honest it is a lot quicker to do a flowchart in Visio if you do this than it is to try and play around with the drawing canvas and the shapes and then the connectors whereas this, these snap into place so for a very simple quick diagram this is your beast click outside and there you have it and if I click on it you can see the object in there and then you just save that as normal so that's just a very quick overview of how to embed a Visio diagram into a Word document so I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you in the next one